Welcome to okay. the world of tomorrow. Shut up, Mike. I'm Sean. We're not starting on this. Wait Mike, until we get into the game. Mike, it, you're going to have to introduce what we're doing. Oh. You, you screwed it up, man. You screwed... I blame you. Let, let's just start. We're playing Halo Combat Evolved, as you can see on Xbox 360. Now, here's a bit of history for the game. It's developed by Bungie and released in 2001. You knew that. What you didn't know is that there was a prequel book. You probably also knew that too. I don't care though. Hey, shut up, Mike. This is just horrible. I We're know. doing horrible. Okay, yeah, so because of some technical difficulties, we're playing it on a small screen provided kindly by Pinnacle Studio. It's about three inches big. I wouldn't call it three inches. Two? I'd call it half of one. Luckily, as you can see, we're playing on easy. Because we can't see shit. <laughs> and because we planned on playing on easy anyway, because we are not here to entertain you. Okay, we are, but we're also here to provide you some information. We'll still likely fail repeatedly because we're on a small split screen. And the loading. How hilarious would it be if it turns out this microphone can't pick us up and we just spent Couple. all this time for nothing? Now we're going to be doing a test run of Pillar of Autumn right now, and if this doesn't work, well, you're never seeing this video, so you don't care. And. And. Halo. Hey. See, Mike, this is so bad. Yeah, the cutscene's not that bad. Let's see when we actually play. Okay, now. Color of Autumn? How much to say there? It's like. It's big. I saw about six long swords. Okay. Nope, this ain't doing anything. Cortana, all I need to know is did we lose them? I think we both know okay. the answer to that. Okay, we probably should have put on, uh, what you call it, subtitles. Other way that, oh, just so you know, Mike can't hear this. Yep, I don't know what's going on. We made a blind jump. Any time. Did they? Get here first. The Covenant ships Wait, have so always you been actually, like, can figure out what's going on from memory? From reach, oh, God, light yeah. speed, my maneuvering options were limited. Basically, they're just... We were running dark. Yes. Until okay. we decelerated. You know, I'll no give the story off the, the hole we tore in subspace. Well, if you stop talking, they can hear it. They were waiting for us on the far side of the planet. So, where do we stand? Our fighters are mopping up the last of their recon picket now. Nothing serious. But I've isolated approach signatures for multiple CCS class battle groups. Make it three capital ships per group. And in about 90 seconds, they'll be all over us. Well, that's it then. Bring the ship back up to combat alert alpha. Everyone, sir? And Cortana. Mm -hmm. Let's give our old friend a warm welcome. I've already begun. Okay. So, basically what happened is... The Pillar of Autumn all escaped your from a horrible battle where thousands of people died by jumping randomly into slip space, but it wasn't random because Cortana knew where she was going. It will make sense if you read the Fall of Reach. Don't. Play the game that's coming out called Halo Reach. Yep. Yeah, Which will most likely have nothing to do with the book. The lady. Move like you got a purpose. Okay, I actually wasn't Sergeant Johnson until the release party for the original Halo. Man, well, your eyes down range, that. fingers on your triggers, and we all go home in one piece. Yeah, but I'm just saying, it was at the release party where he got his name, Sergeant Johnson. Until then, it was just Sniper Sergeant. Double time. Attention all personnel. We are re-engaging the enemy. Extra uh, contact in all you greenhorns who wanted to see Covenant up close, this is gonna be your. Hey, just so you know, the scene we just saw has different voiceover from Sergeant Johnson, depending on what difficulty level you're playing on. Sure. Right. Let's thaw him out. Okay. Here's our protagonist. Systems online. 
Cracking the case in 30 seconds. Our good friend, Master Chief. Who's sleep? He's hot. Blowing the pins in five. Our heroes, ladies and gentlemen. Hero. I don't care. I guess technically we're heroes. Yep, because there's two of us right there. And now we get to see how really nightmarish this is going to be. And... This Not isn't bad. so bad. We're probably going to be bad. <laughs> when the explosions start happening, we're not going to see anything. And... Boom! Oh, that guy died. Just callous disregard for human life on all our parts. Nice pee bag. Oh god, fire. My one true weakness. Don't mind us, they don't have guns. So why don't you give us the gun? Considering we're... Never mind. Fuck them, let's just run. We're actual soldiers here. We can't punch or anything, you know. Have fun dying. Out of the way. On the bridge, ASAP. No, you get it. I'm strong enough to flip over a tank with my mind, but I can't punch unless I have a gun. I know you're dead. Oh god! Oh god! Yeah, I'm almost dead. dead. Uh -huh. When I get the pistol, I'm knocking you upside the head. Good. Oh, yeah, you can read a bunch of things. Ah! Damn it, Mike. Captain Key. <clears throat> Mike, Good to see you, Mike, you have to give me a chance Things to, you know, do well. stuff. Cortana did her best, but we never had a chance. That doesn't they mean it's superior stuff battleships against a single Halcyon class cruiser. Yeah, but I'm gonna show them where that stuff is. Make that four kids. Sleep well? No thanks to your driving, yes. So you did miss me. If it gets really bad, we'll just drop the Report. noise level of the audio of their track. Things. That I we're guess an anti-matter charge. Yeah. Control for the main cannon is offline. Captain, the cannon was my last offensive option. All right. I'm initiating cold. Oh, oh, just give me a gun. I really don't care. Okay. And you too, Cortana. While you do what? Go down with the ship? In a manner of speaking. The object we found. I'm going to try and land the autumn on it. With all due respect, sir, this war has enough dead heroes. I appreciate your concern, Cortana, but it's not up to me. Protocol is clear. Destruction or capture of a shipboard AI is absolutely unacceptable, and that means you're leaving ship. Lock in a selection of emergency landing zones, upload them to my neural lace. Aye, aye, sir. Which is where you come in, Chief. Get Cortana off this ship. Keep her safe from the enemy. Okay, yeah, we're probably gonna stop right here everything. so that we can put Force set up audio for Mike research. here. Because up until now, I've been hogging the, uh... The what you call it? Audio. I prefer this cut of course. Not that you'll listen, but I'd suggest letting my subroutines handle the final approach. Excellent work, Cortana. Thank you. Are you ready? Good luck, Master Chief. I mean, how do I fit that? Your architecture isn't much different from the Autumn's. Don't get any funny ideas. I don't keep it loaded. Oh, trust me, we know it's loaded. Yeah, it's it's loaded, okay? Deal with it. 